Rich with Rich Baum Photography, Sacramento, California. And I just want to do a little demonstration showing you how a little mirrorless camera is the answer for pole photography. Now, a lot of people are saying, oh, you've got to get a, a wonder, uh, I forget what it's called, mega mast. Uh, you got to get a wonder pole. You've got to get this and get that. Well, I believe in the Wooster uh, Sherlock pole. You can't read mine anymore because I've been using it for five years. Same pole for five years. I probably raised it up and down 10,000 times. I've never had a break. I've never had a problem. I feel very confident. I do use a stainless steel bolt, so I feel good about it. But I've gone from trying to add a ball head and a clamp on top, and now I just keep the screw on there, the bolt on there, and screw it directly into my L bracket. And it's so fast and easy literally takes four seconds five seconds there we go and it's a firm connection oh by the way this is just a piece of sock that is attached over the front of this because the pvc if it hits the back back window of the car will uh, leave a little bit of white mark so my wife told me i'll put a sock there and a little zip tie so anyway got that there you can find out how to build the connector on my youtube channel so anyway here's let's just do a demonstration how super quick and easy it is this a6400 and i used to use the a6000 inexpensive light compact the uh samyang 12 millimeter lens is i it's manual focus but i set it i taped it down right here you can see i put a piece of tape on the focal ring and i never have to focus it so it works great I've got my iPad here so I can see what I'm doing. No need for a level on your camera. Someone said today, how do you um, level your camera? Well, you just eyeball it, okay? So let's just show you how we do it. Okay, so this is it unextended. Sometimes I use it like this. I can lift it up with one hand, no problem. Move it around without fear of dropping it. My iPad, I can just have like this, I don't have to touch it. I can see exactly what I'm doing. And when I want to extend it, I'm just going like this. There we go, up and down. Up and down, walk around without looking at it, without just one hand, no problem. You know, I'm not that strong. I'm able to do it because it's a nice light setup. So let's just take it down. I can put it over my shoulder if I need to walk with it to another location. When I'm doing this, I'm putting it up and down maybe 10 shots, 15 shots, 20 shots in 10 minutes, five minutes. So it works great. And sure, a lot of you are saying, well, just get a drone. Well, for me, this works a little better in many, many situations that I don't really want to put up a drone or hire somebody with a drone or do, or do any of that. And, you know, stick with your drone if you want, but for pole, it works for me, okay? And again, it's so fast to put up, just like this. Down, up, down, up. And, you know, you, you guys might be thinking that, oh, it's gonna eventually break. You know what? Again, I probably put this up and down. This is my original pole, $49, I think, $46. I've had this for five years and I probably put it up and down at least 5,000 times, maybe 10,000 times. No problem whatsoever. Fits right in my car. You can see my little Subaru Outback there. I used to have a Ford Fusion, so it's right in the car. No problem. So again, get yourself this pole, but get yourself a, a mirrorless, small mirrorless camera. You'll thank yourself later. There we go. Full extension. There you go. Bam. Really, really easy. There you go. Up and down. Okay. Rich with Rich Bomb Photography saying thanks for checking in and, uh, you know, just uh, whatever you do, use what works for you. This just happens to work for me. It's the Wooster Pole, and on my YouTube video, which will be in the show notes, you can see how to make it, what to buy, and uh, you know, it's, it's really simple. Just go to your Home Depot, go in the PVC section, go in the, the bolt section, and whatever you do, get a stainless steel bolt. It works great, but uh, you know, it's really simple and so nice and easy, and it just goes really, really fast, up and down, you know? And again, it just works for me.